Hi everyone, happy December 27th. I hope this video finds you well. So technology is all around us and you really can't run away from it. There's very few people that don't have cell phones nowadays. But when I first got my cell phone, I actually had a pager first, then I went into a cell phone. My first cell phone didn't even have a slot for any extra storage. So all I remember was being able to hold 56 numbers. Now, if you wanted more, you had to figure out who you were gonna delete. Well, that was fine, and eventually I upgraded, and I upgraded, and then I upgraded, and eventually one of my very first phones had this. This bad boy was 128 megabyte. This was the shiznit. I was able to figure out that I can put pictures on here and one song. I thought that was the coolest. Then I eventually upgraded to the next level and the next level, and I got this. Now a 512 megabyte, I figured out how to put tons of music on there, a whole five songs, all my pictures, and then even at that, all my storage for all my phone numbers. That made me happy. I eventually upgraded to my phone and I got a one gigabyte. I was elated. I didn't even know what I was gonna do with all this storage. I knew I can hold music on it. So that made me really happy. But nowadays, you get any phone and it basically comes with the same card. This one. It's the micro SD card. Now, normally they have been upgrading and putting four gigabyte and eight gigabytes in all the phones. This actually happens to be a 64 gigabyte, but it's crazy. You look at one gigabyte to this, which, let me, hold it in such a way, to this, 64 gigabyte, one gigabyte. Seriously, there's not even a real comparison there. Now, going to another edge of the spectrum, you got this. It's an external hard drive. Now this was the cat's meow. It's two whole gigabytes. I did not know what to do with myself, but what I did find out is it holds music and videos and I was pretty happy. But you think about it, this, two gigabyte, this, 64. Crazy? I think so. But then I upgraded, and then I upgraded a couple more times, and I upgraded a couple more times. And the same company came out with this, which it looks about the same. Well, it's, this one actually is a little bit darker than this. That's about the only thing. Other than the fact that this is a 750 gigabyte and this is still a two. Same size, same width. But then I upgraded again to this. This is a five terabyte. This is still a two gigabyte. Same size. Technology. You never know. Now the reason why I'm talking about this is today I actually had to take a step back in technology. Now when I woke up today I turned on my cell phone and it didn't respond. So I took out the battery, let it go for a few minutes, put it back in. It wasn't responding. I went into my daughter's phone. I figured maybe, just maybe, it was the battery. Well, I changed the battery, and lo and behold, it pops on. I'm like, okay, so I just need to get a new battery. Well, it got stuck in the splash screen. So I took out the battery, put in mine into her phone, started right up. I'm like, oh, okay, so it's not the battery. So I'm thinking maybe it's the SD card. Now in my phone, I happen to have this one, which is a 64 gigabyte, and I switched out that, started right up on my daughter's, didn't start up on mine. So I don't know what's going on with it, but eventually this afternoon I started playing with it and it finally came on and it got to the splash screen and that's where it stayed. So I called T-Mobile and lo and behold they said the memory has been zapped somehow, some way. So I'm back to my old trusty Blackberry that I had just before my MyTouch, which is just crazy because I'm looking at this. And to make a video on my MyTouch, it actually does a 
1080p, which is high definition. And the highest this will do, I'm not sure if you can see that, is a 240 by 180. That's the highest it will go. And I thought that was the shiznit. I recorded some videos on this and I uploaded them to YouTube. In fact, uh, my video last year, if I remember right, or two years ago, where we got all that snow and we had 10 inches outside, it was recorded on this. And I look back at that video and go, why? Why did I record on this when I had a camera? But who knows? But I'm stuck with my old Blackberry until tomorrow. I did call T-Mobile. They are sending it overnight service, so I will have my new My Touch tomorrow. But unfortunately, I'm working a double tomorrow, so I will probably not get it until midnight tomorrow night. So my Blackberry will be my friend. But the bad part about it is that all my phones, all my phone numbers are on my My Touch. Yep, they're all gone. And I really don't want to hook this up to the My the uh, T-Mobile because of course, you know, it'll take time to bring over the phone numbers and all that. So, I figure it's only one day. How bad can it be? There's only a few numbers that I need. So, if you are watching this and you have my cell phone number, send me a text message and say, "Hey, this is state your name so at least I will have your phone number because there's a lot of phone numbers that I put in there and I did not up, um, upload it to the T-Mobile site. Technology, it's killing me. I mean after all, all the addresses I lost for all the Christmas cards and birth dates and then now my phone. I guess I just better go back in time where I don't need a phone. Maybe I'll go get a pager. Anyways, I'll talk to you the day after tomorrow's yesterday. Good night.